A mural on the side of the Spot Tavern in Lafayette is causing controversy among neighbors. Lafayette Mayor Tony Rozworski has asked the owner of the bar to consider removing or altering the art, but so far the bar managers say they're not sure they want to. News 18's Kayla Sullivan reports the law says they don't necessarily have to. I don't find anything inherently offensive about it. If anything, I think it's actually pretty comical. But nearby neighbor Isla Solomon doesn't find the public art funny. You may have seen Solomon before on News 18 as the woman who pleaded guilty for trying to feed her husband's body to the birds. Now she's on a mission to clean up Lafayette's image by petitioning to get this mural out of sight of children. I definitely doesn't, don't think it says we're a caring town towards our children. Lafayette Mayor Tony Rozworski doesn't necessarily disagree. I personally would not like to see that on the side of a building that close to a, uh, where we have kids walking by and things like that. I'm not sure that, I'm not sure what value that really brings to, to the building or to the, the neighborhoods down there. But the Spot Tavern's manager, Kelly DeRolf, says she doesn't know why this art would offend children. If it really is coming down to the children, it's kind of unhealthy even to create this environment where we're censoring genitalia that's not even being used in a sexual uh, degree. Solomon argues the art is alluding to sex. There's a female that's tied to dead wood, which of course is a bondage type of sexual act. Mayor Wozworski had his legal team look into it, and they say it does not meet the standards to be categorized as obscene. But it's kind of a tricky balancing act with First Amendment rights and what people consider art, so we have to be careful about that. I, I know uh, that we've had a city representative talk to the building owner. He says Paul Baldwin owns the tavern as well as the Black Sparrow in town and is a respected man in the community. The city hopes they can come to a compromise with the bar. Solomon suggests expanding his outdoor seating. I'm sure Paul Baldwin could come up with something so children didn't have to view the art. Manager DeRolf says they'll consider a compromise depending on what it may be. Kayla Sullivan, News 18.